Gary Gensler failed the U.S. crypto industry, and so has Congress. The Securities and Exchange Commission chair is a rational actor. U.S. lawmakers have been derelict in their duties. By Paolo Tasca Tasca Jun 28, 2023 at 5.46 p.m. UK updated June 28, 2023 at 5.54 p.m. UK by Paolo Tasca Tasca Jun 28. 2023 at 5.46 p.m. UK updated June 28, 2023 at 5.54 p.m. UK by Paolo Tasca Tasca Jun 28, 2023 at 5.46 p.m. UK updated June 28, 2023 at 5.54 p.m. UK We are entering the summer of the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission, SEC. The agency's latest actions against the world's foremost exchanges, Coinbase and Binance, have the crypto sector reeling. Major players are making moves, quickly. Crypto.com announced it will wind down its U.S. institutional business due to limited demand. Robin Hood testified last week in a House crypto hearing about the complete lack of help it received from the SEC in registering as a digital assets broker. Dr. Paolo Tasca is a professor and economist at University College London the founder of the DLT Science Foundation, DSF, and member of the Blockchain Technical Committee at the International Organization for Standardization, ISO. He advises several companies, including Hedera Hashgraph and Anat but this isn't a full accounting of the SEC's recent activities or crypto's response, there is far more to explore. But the ringleader of the chaos is Gary Gensler, the current chairperson of the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission. Robin Hood. Etoro and other major brokers have began delisting tokens from some of the most prominent blockchain projects. Follow the URL for the full article for more on this story. Visit the news article link.